In this video, we will be studying about a number line. See what is the number line? How do we draw a number line? Take a scale and draw the straight line. Right? After that, what you do? You mark this as 0. Here there are negative numbers. We all know the number line that is minus 1, minus 2, minus 3. On the right side, we keep on increasing the numbers. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Now this is a number line. See, the distance between 0 to 1, then 1, 2, 2, one, two, two 3, 3 to 4, 4 to 5, 5 to 6. It should be equal. It should be same. So the, this distance is known as your unit distance. So the distance between the points, the distance between the these points is called unit distance. Right? So the, the distance you will keep as same. You will take a scale, you will uh, draw a line, you will start from 0 and after that on the scaling, you will use scale to form it. From 0 to 1, you will denote 1. Then after 1 to 2, you will have 1. Then 2 to 3, you will do 1. In this way, you will get the equal distance on the number line. Now let's study the addition on the number line, subtraction on the number line and the multiplication on the number line. Let's understand the addition on the number line. And see, I have taken two questions that is 5 plus 3 and 6 plus 5. So let's make the number line first. We'll start from 0, then 1. See, keep the same distance. I don't have scale, so I'm not, I am not able to keep the same distance. Keep the same distance and then draw. Now, how we will may I do the addition? See, from 0, first take a big jump to 5. We have to add 5 to 3. So, take a big jump to 5. After taking big jump to 5, add other 3 on it. Take small jumps 1, 2 and 3. First take a big jump to 5 which is the first digit and you have to add 3 more to it. Take small small 3 jumps and you get the answer 8. We all know that 5 plus 3 is 8 but this is how we calculate it on the number line. Then again let's calculate 6 plus 5. Seven, then eight, then nine, then ten, eleven, then twelve, right? So what we will do? We will shift from zero to six, and after that we will shift. Then we will take small jumps, uh, five jumps. So let's take a big jump from zero to six because first digit is six. Now add five more to it. So take five small jumps. One, two. 3, 4 and 5. So answer is 11. So if you add manually you will get 6 plus 5 is equal to 11. This is how you calculate it on the number line. Let's understand the subtraction on number line. Let's draw a number line. 2, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and then 10. Now you need to subtract. In addition what we used to do? You, we used to jump to the first number which is 9. So in the same way we will jump from 0 to 9. And after that if we had to add 2 to it we will jump to forward. Now if we need to subtract 2 from it. So we will take a Backward jump from 9 to 2 backward jumps from 9 to 8 then 8 to 7 so the answer is 7 in addition we take the forward jumps small jumps in uh, subtraction we take the backward small jumps 
After that, zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then ten. Now, first, what you will do? You will take a bigger jump to six. From zero to six, you will take a bigger jump. Take a bigger jump from zero to six. Now what you have to do, you need to subtract from from uh, four from six. So take a four backward steps. One, two, three, and four. So the answer here is two. So this is the way you do the subtraction on number line. Now we will study the multiplication on number line. Let's draw the number line. Same distance, take the digits 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, and 14. Let's take it together. Now, if you have to multiply, then what you do? There is 2 into 6. So, what you do? You take the jump of 2 to 6 times. You jump. From 1 to 2 once, then 2 to 4 second time, then 4 to 6 third time, 6 to 8 fourth time, then 8 to 10 fifth time, then 11 to 12 sixth time. So you are taking a gap of 2 2 and you are taking 6 jumps because you have to find out multiplication of 2 with 6. So you will take 2 jumps till six times so this is how you do show multiplication on the number line let's see this zero one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen now, 5 into 3, which means you have to take a distance of 5 3 times. So, this is from 1 to 5, you are taking 1. Then, after 5 to 10, you are taking the other. And then, 10 to 15, you are taking the third one. So, you are taking 3 jumps with a distance of 5 5 each. So, this is how you represent multiplication on your number. Line. I hope you have understood this. Do download our scholars learning app and enjoy the learning experience with us.